funny, guys. Is it? <laughs> Hi, this is my second day isolated because of COVID. And I can tell you now that my entire family has it. My kids, their mother, my brother, his daughters, his wife. I mean, my girlfriend doesn't have it yet, but fingers crossed. I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. Thank you very much to those of you that have written to me and expressed your concern. I know, I know we're not alone. I know we're not alone. Anyway, today I want to tell you more about Corey. Yesterday I showed you the first video when uh, I went to Madrid to see her. We put her in the best hospital in the city and we started looking at her problem. Corey has mega esophagus, which is a condition that stops her from being able to eat. The esophagus doesn't bring the food into her stomach. Now, many of you have said, ah, this is very easy. Just put her on a Bailey chair. Mm, yes, but no. First, we have to see what is the reason for the mega esophagus and if there's anything that we can do medically to, to alleviate the condition and maybe even solve it altogether. We've had several cases in the past where there was an issue called ductus, which is a heart issue with a, with a vein that basically stops the esophagus from, from opening and that creates this dilation. Anyway, this is a complicated medical issue that we're trying to figure out. Today, you're gonna see the second day, all the tests that we, that we are doing on Cori and uh, fingers crossed for her. Have a look at this, this is Cori. Hola, Cori. Hola, You have you seen what we've done? We've done a CT scan, we've done ultrasound, we even went inside her esophagus to see how it looks and if there's any other reason that we can identify. For now, she's at the hospital, she's uh, in pretty bad shape, although you can see her, she's uh, medic I mean, clinically she's happy and she's aware and everything, but, uh, but we need to do something, otherwise things are gonna get complicated from here. I really wanna thank you for your support. Please donate, help me take care of Cory. All these tests, all these procedures, and all the treatment that is gonna follow uh, is something that without you, we will not be able to perform. Cory needs you. Please, if you can, donate. She's beautiful. Please help me save her life. Thank you.